Hi, everyone. Welcome to review session three on numerical data. In lecture three, we're going to turn our attention from categorical data to numerical data. We'll display and summarize various features of numerical data using what is called descriptive statistics. So our overview will be by beginning by describing some uh, common shapes of distributions that you'll encounter. Then we will talk about measures, measures of center, measures of location, and measures of variation or spread. For this, for this review session, I will focus on part A. I'll present parts B and C at our regular, uh, regular section that meets on Monday um, afternoon. So our focus in this review session will be part A. So what's descriptive statistics? Well, descriptive statis statistics are used to describe the basic features of the data of a study. They provide simple summaries about the, simp uh, the sample and the measures. Together with simple graphic analysis, they form the basis of virtually every kind of quantitative analysis there is. So in part A, we will, uh, we will examine measures of center, location, and spread. Before we study these measures, let's begin uh, with looking at some graphic displays of some of the common shapes that you'll encounter as we move through the course. Uh, the six shapes that you will most likely encounter are unimodal, bimodal, multimodal, symmetric, skewed right, and skewed left. So let's take a look at each of these. Here is an example of a unimodal uh, graph. We'll see that there's one big peak at the center and that's very, very prominent. Here's an example of a bimodal distribution. You'll notice that there are two peaks, pretty obvious peaks, uh, of, of two different distributions. Um, so uh, we call this bimodal. Here's an example of a multimodal distribution, more than two peaks. Now, you'll notice that the peaks aren't exactly of the same height, but that's okay. We see clearly that there are three different uh, peaks uh, within this graph. We'll also be talking a great deal about uh, what are called symmetric distributions. Here we have one peak in the center, unimodal, but the, and the tails move out to the sides. Um, and it's probably the most common uh, recognizable distribution um, that we will encounter. Here's an example of a skewed distribution. Notice where that tail goes. The tail moves into the right direction. And therefore, we call this particular distribution skewed right. In contrast, we see this graphic display where the tail uh, moves to the left-hand side, and we call this skewed left. This concludes our discussion of data distributions and descriptive statistics. Next, we'll discuss measures of center.